Hello everyone, welcome back to my channel. I thought I would make light of a bad situation and have my chemo hair pink. What you think? In today's video I'm sharing you my empties because lately I've amassed a bunch of empty products. I have a nylon bag, stylishly, and also like a, a cardboard box full of stuff. Let's get started! Let's start with body products, I feel like that would be the best way to go. First of all, shampoos, because I have so many shampoos that I have used up during the summer and also spring and up until now that it's kind of crazy. So I have a tiny bit of it left, but I mean, yeah. This is the Ice Bonbon Surprise um, by Treckle Moon. That's the brand. I was looking for the brand name and it smelled and this one smells like well it did smell like chewing gum but in a good way so I definitely definitely loved it I actually took it with me to the hospital this was my hospital little um, shower gel this was very nice I used this up during the um, I think springtime so this is the white gloss by Balea, which is from uh, Drogery Marked, and this is peach. No, this is white raspberry and lily scented. I think very very amazing scent. I mean Balea has the best scent ever. Okay, I used up the Brazilian foreplay. This was amazing, but for the price. I don't think I'll ever buy this again. This smells nice and makes your skin really, really soft. And if it's within your budget, then go ahead by all means. But I just don't think I will purchase this again. I still have the Bum Bum Cream and the Coco Cabana Cream. Um, but I will not buy this one because it's really, really expensive for what it is. So yeah, but I used it up. It was really, really nice. Okay, the Baba is the Hungarian brand that I love, love, love. I just really do love. And this was the Caribbean Dream Summer Vacation or something. Like summer memories or something. And it's um, star fruit and coconut. This was so, so nice for the summer. Then the other baba is the aloe vera avocado. This is a classic one. They always have this and I love this scent. And I almost used up the watermelon one. Well, kind of several of them because I used one last year and I bought one this year. It's almost gone, but you know, not quite just yet, but I love that one as well. This is my absolute favorite. I just need to need to repurchase this. This is the Vanilla Pumpkin Shower Gel from The Body Shop. They always come out with this during fall. And I love it. I have the hand cream and the body butter. And I just need to buy like at least two of these so that they will last me until next season. Because they always come out with this. They're always so, so nice. Love this. This is one of my favorite scents, like, ever. Yeah, well, this was fun. This is the Isana, which is a Rossman brand. Um, pistachio um, shower gel. This is really, really nice. I love pistachio, so it was fun to use. I don't think they have it anymore, though. I think it was limited edition, so that's not cute. And I think probably this was um, all of the shower gels. I kind of thought it would be more, but... Well, anyways, moving on. What else? I think... No, 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 I still have another one. This is the Dove Go Fresh Cucumber and Green Tea Scent, Scented Shower Gel. Loved it. I actually have this in a deodorant. And this is something that I might repurchase because I love it so much. Like for summer, all of these scents, perfect. Now let's move on to like hair stuff. I mean, back when I still did have hair. Actually, I still use some hair stuff. I use um, shampoo on my hair. And I still use like um, conditioner, you know, so that it would grow better or something. I don't know. Anyways, I used up the tea gel from Neutrogena. I used to have dandruff, not anymore because I can totally treat my scalp now. But I mean, it's it's a good thing to have when you have any itchy scalp and problems. 
I also used up the Pure Detox Micellar Hair Shampoo from Nivea. Love this stuff. This was probably the best thing ever. I loved it. I mean, had I had hair, I would repurchase it, but just not right now. <laughs> I'm currently using a Sios one that I bought like last year and found it. And um, it's, it's a huge bottle. It would last me for 10 years with this kind of a hair. <laughs> but moving on. What else? Do we have other hair stuff? Yeah, back when I still had hair. It's kind of like a theme. I used up this dry shampoo, which is from Dove Hair Therapy Refreshing Care Dry Shampoo. It was nice, but honestly, I've had better. And also, I'm just thinking about it. I used up this one just now, actually, like 15 minutes ago before I started filming. This is the Colorista spray, one day color. You can actually wash this out of your hair. And I used the hot pink one for this color that I'm having right now. So at least this is gone because I've had this for like two years or something, honestly. So it was time I used this up. Okay, what else? Hair, I think, is done. Yeah, I used up a perfume. There's a dog coming in a color. Sad was. I used up a perfume, well, uh, I guess a body fragrance mist or something from Victoria's Secret. This is called Secret Charm and this was my favorite scent, but I mean it lasts about five minutes so I'll never repurchase any of these things again. So no. And then I used up quite a lot of body stuff I think, like body lotions. Well considering I don't use any of this stuff ever. I used up this spar. Rocky! I used up this spar budget almond scented um, body lotion. I used up two of these. I don't know where the other one was. Probably it was in my previous video. This was the Balia Rose Elegance, which is my favorite scent, which was unfortunately limited edition. This was Rose and Guava. Um, scented, perfect, perfect scent. Now it's gone. And I also kind of use that you can tell because there is just, you know, that much. Well, it's totally empty. I used up the Creighton's Simply Strawberry Refresh. I used up the Creighton's Simply Strawberry Refresh Body Lotion. This smelled like strawberry ice cream. I loved it. Unfortunately, it's not really available in my country anymore, so probably I should order it online from somewhere, but I would definitely, definitely repurchase. So if you have this available to you, please buy this because it's amazing. It softens your skin so, so well and smells amazing. Lovely product. One other thing, which is kind of like a body thing, I'm just kind of finding other stuff is the exfoliating body scrub from Dove and this is the kiwi seeds and cool aloe scent. I loved it so much, now it's gone, but it's an amazing product. Um, I would repurchase it, but there are so many fun things I want to keep, you know, trying new stuff, but if there weren't any, like, fun things, then I would buy it, but since there are so many products, I probably wouldn't, I probably won't, but I still loved it so much. Okay, a little bit of face stuff, like skincare-ish type of things. Um, I have the Visibly Clear. This is the grapefruit scented uh, cream wash, which I used up. I liked it, but I will not rebuy this because, no. It wasn't that great. And I have other things that I want to use. I used up a micellar water from Garnier. I love this. I will repurchase this as soon as I'm uh, out of the other stuff because I just loved it so much. I think it's a little bit better than the Nivea, so definitely a favorite. Okay, skincare-ish type of things. I really need to re, um, like reuse the, I really need to recycle these and take these back to Kiehl's. This is a Kiehl's Pure Vitality Skin Renewing Cream. It was okay, but I will not repurchase this. But something that I would totally consider repurchasing from Kiehl's was the Hydro Plumping Retexturizing Serum Concentrate, which I used together and I loved it. These were so beautiful, like together, but mostly this one. I think this made this cream just so much better. 
So I used up those. I have another body lotion because I'm just finding stuff. This is the warm and cozy Rose and Magnolia scent. So great from uh, Bali as well. I used up a face serum, which is the Nutrigold from L'Oreal. It's just like a face oil, but it was really, really beautiful and made my skin plump and hydrated and I loved it. And I also used up the Clinique Smart Treatment Oil, which was also very nice for my skin. And then a bunch of samples. I used up the Dramatically Different Moisturizer, uh, 7 Day Scrub Cream. We have the Estee Lauder Advanced Night Repair that I used up. And I kind of wanted to get rid of all of my samples, so basically I went in and just used up a bunch of them. So those are gone. I keep finding stuff, so I still have another hair product. I used up, used this one up, you know, before I lost all my hair. This was the Magic Retouch by L'Oreal. This is in dark, dark blonde. I think I might wanna like buy some of these like in different colors and then just spray it on my scalp and then have, have it look, and, and then just have, you know, hair. This kind of looking thing on, on the top of my head. So, oops, I'm dropping it. But I think I might want to like buy different colors of this and just make my buzz cut look a bit more thick than it actually is. So this is a good product. I kind of like it. Yet again, a hair thing, which is amazing how many things I have when I still had hair. I used up a Got To Be powerful um, retexture volumizing styling powder. I would not buy this again because it's itchy. Cause it's sticky it makes your hair stick and it's weird i like it because it may it really makes a difference but it's sticky so just no now probably a little bit of makeup i kind of have a, a makeup here which is kind of surprising but i do i used up a bunch of powders I have to be honest with you i use these up on my body and not on my face you know whenever i, I sweat i would just you know put it on kind of like talk or something. So I used up the Face Studio setting powder, the Can Stop, Won't Stop banana powder. Um, which one is this? The Freedom Pro Artist. And is there anything else? Probably not. No, no more powders. So I used up three powders this year. It's kind of good, I think. And I keep finding stuff, yeah. I used up also um, a sample of Moisture Surge. Also a moisture surge. <laughs> I'm currently using a moisture surge and also an ultra facial cream. So all of my samples I used up, which was so so good for me. Then makeup, more makeup, then more makeup. I used up a Smashbox Studio Skin Foundation. That was the only foundation because I was mainly using like um, concealer, not so much foundation this year. I used up uh, the matte finish from NYX, also a primer, the hydrating primer from uh, Maybelline. I finished my uh, Belle Hypoallergenic. I finished up my Belle highlighter. I also kind of made a body shine highlight of this. This is the Vivid Golden Lights Baked Highlighter from Revolution. You cannot even tell it's so worn off, but now it's completely gone. I use it on my face and also my body during the summer because I was kind of having fun. And this is an Alverda bronzer that I finished, thankfully. It was, though it was really, really nice because it was vanilla sugar scented and the best thing to put on your face, honestly. But now it's gone and it was, I think, limited edition, so it's gone now. And I also finished the Spectral Light Eyeshadow Glow Kit from Catrice. And now to the lip products. I finished up this old Avon lip gloss. Old Avon lipstick, let me see. Yeah, completely gone. You can tell this was my go-to when I was filming videos. Um, and I finished up a bunch of stuff, I have to say, because I'm making my own lip colors now. Because it just occurred to me. So I have these little pots and then I just scrape things and then just mix up lipsticks at home. So these are the lip colors that I make for myself. And while doing that, I use up a bunch of my lipsticks. 
So this freedom red one is gone. You can tell there is nothing left. This one also from Bourgeois. This is a beautiful product, but the color just wasn't exactly good for me. So I mixed it up with other colors and then it worked. And then Miss Porty is gone. And this is the Coral Power Maybelline Peach Buff is gone. NYX Strawberry Milk is gone. Catrice Prismachrome in the 020. And um, this is also a Freedom one, which means it's kind of older. And this is called the Retro Flashback. And it's a really cute pink, but it did not exactly work for my face. But now it does because I mixed it up with another color. So this was everything. I'm so glad I've shown you all of my empties because now I can throw all of these out and I can just clean my room. So that's it, you guys. These were my empties. I hope you liked it. And until the next time, bye-bye.